hi everyone it's Ann today we're gonna look at a brand new deck it's been out I think of a couple months so not brand spanking new like not just this month but it's it's fairly new um, it's the latest deck um, by Shiro Marchetti called mystic palette to row it comes in a hard case um, magnetic box and there are two version of this a colorful version a color version and a sepia version um, which doesn't have any color or less color sepia all right so magnetic so it flips open and this is the guidebook we'll take a look at it after the card so opens this way pretty scenery there cards are on the bottom there is this pretty purple ribbon to easily remove the cards nice purple inner lining for the purple lovers purple ribbon to match all right A nice picture of the fool there and it close up all right so that is the box and here are the backs of the cards and they are reversible they are beautifully gilded and I don't know why mine came with scratches in them like this but that's the luck of the draw sometimes they're perfect and sometimes there's little scratches and you can see there's little sparkles in them also they're kind of like a they're a copper color I don't know if you can tell there with the lighting but yeah see so they're like a copper copper color there and that's probably the closest to the true color right there copper they are very beautiful mine just has little scratches in them but it's not too bad all right they are a little slippery because they are very laminated than usual they're not matte I'm surprised they're glossy um, comparing it to a plaid back traditional tarot card it is larger so it's taller by that much and wider by that much taller and wider all right all right so without further ado let's take a look at the cards they are beautiful as most of his decks are or all of his deck shiro marsetti i think i have most of them if not all of them all right so uh they are borderless and the number is at the bottom but there is no um keywords all right so i think is that good enough or should we zoom in a little bit more get it tight all right so that is the full magician I hope this is straight all right and the high priestess beautiful colors look at that his stack doesn't disappoint I have to say that it's like they never disappoint all right empress the emperor the higher font the lovers the chariot strength so it's a white tiger instead of a lion but I like it different the hermit the wheel of fortune justice the hanged man death 
the star. I'm sorry, this is temperance. Temperance. The devil. The tower. This is the star. Let's see. They're both pouring. They're both pouring. One is like a close up front view. And one is a side profile view. Very pretty. All right. So this is the star. I like this. Beautiful. Look at that. And the moon. The sun. Judgment. The world. So that completes the major arcana. Now we'll move to the minor arcana starting with the swords. We have Ace of Swords, Two of Swords, Three of Swords. It's interesting that he chose a male for the Three of Swords because usually it's the female um, in the Three of Swords. So I really like that because, you know, men have emotions too, right? And gets their heart broken also. So I like that. It would be cool if he had a male and a female, like two you know two cards but I'm happy we have enough uh, cards with just the female but I really like that all right <coughs> uh, four of swords <coughs> five of swords six of swords this is another view right instead of looking from behind where we get the frontal view, but then in the background we get the, the view we're familiar with. So I'd like that too. Very, very different, unique angle and perspective in this deck. Um, seven of Swords. Eight of Swords, so it's very traditional here. Nine of Swords. Ten of Swords. Page of Swords. Knight of Swords, Queen of Swords, and King of Swords. Next is the suit of Wands or Rods. So we have Ace of Wands, Two of Wands. This is very cool. It reminds me of Twin Flame colors for Twin Flame readers. You know, the blue and the red and combining, connecting. It actually reminds me of a Two of Cups instead of Two of Wands. Very cool. Three of Wands. Four of Wands. Five of Wands. Six of Wands. Seven of Wands. Eight of Wands. Nine of Wands. Ten of Wands. Page of Wands, Knight of Wands, Queen of Wands, and King of Wands. Next suit is Suit of Pentacles or Coins. So we have Ace of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, and King of Pentacles. Final suit of cups with ace of cups, two of cups, three of cups, four of cups, five of cups, 
Six of Cups. Seven of Cups. Eight of Cups. Nine of Cups. Ten of Cups. Page of Cups. Nine of Cups. Queen of Cups. And King of Cups. And here is the back one more time. Very fiery, very wand-like energy in the back of the deck. All right, so let's zoom back out and we will take a look at the guidebook. So it comes in this bag and whenever you, and I purchased the, the, the deck directly from him on Etsy but he does have his own website as well and whenever you purchase a deck directly from him you always get an extra card with the, his autograph so this is the extra card with his autograph and what's neat about this deck is that there is actually a guidebook that comes with it usually his decks do not have a guidebook that comes with it when you buy directly from him. But this one, the Mystic Palette Tarot, actually comes with a nice larger size guidebook. Oh, so this was published in, yeah, 2021. I think it was, it came out the last um, couple months um, of the year. So not that long ago. Probably. I know for sure the last quarter. I don't know if it was October, November, or December. All right, so there's the preface. Oh, they go over to the Roman numeral number of the Major Arcana. Oh, very pretty. Introduction by Ciro Marchetti. So he actually writes the introduction to this. Very cool. So, a few pages. And then here are some examples. Four of Cups. Examples of three. Of, I guess he's still, that's him writing. Okay. Part one, the Major Arcana. So we go into the Major Arcana, the Fool, the Magician. So they do have, um, pictures from the card, not exactly the card pictures, but elements of the pictures from the cards. And then there's about two pages on each card, it looks like. That's pretty. So strength, get a colorful picture. How about that? The rest are black and white. And this, why is this in color? the star so I guess there's a few cards that they chose to make in color and then we have part two the minor arcana there's a few color pictures and then um, the minor arcana has about two paragraphs of write-up so less writing but still similar format as the major and there's a few pages that have color page night so here are the court cards cool they put in one page did they do that for all the court cards oh so all the court cards get a paragraph write-up but they show them all on one page I like that it's like a little overview of all the court cards like a little family and then here's the coins I like that that's pretty cool all right so you can see them all on one page part three the mystic palette spread so they give you a sample spread for the deck reading one example reading two example with the palette mystic um, spread and then colorful last page so there's a total of 120 okay so nice little guidebook 
And that completes the uh, walkthrough of the uh, Mystic Palette Tarot by Shiro Marchetti. So if you are a Shiro Marchetti fan and you have not picked up this deck yet, it may be somewhat something you want to add to your collection or um, if it's not to your liking maybe you can pass but most people do like his deck I'm sure not everyone but I am a collector of his deck so it's been out for a while um, I just got mine I think about a week ago or so but I haven't had a chance to do the walkthrough until today so I hope you enjoy it um, I'm not gonna put a link on this because it's not on Amazon but like I said I got it off of Etsy and, the, and then he has his own um, website as well which I'm sure you can find alright so thanks for watching again and I will catch you again in the next video bye